good day viewers in this video i'll be teaching you about a framework called brief uh, beef uh, beef is a browser exploitation framework uh, so uh, this is how to install beef uh, but before we go on hacking is illegal if you must hack do it ethically or with appropriate permission so here it's when you open your terminal you type uh, beef b e uh, f uh, dash x s s you hit enter so if you have beef it's going to start but when you don't have it just like me you just uh, click y which is yes and you hit enter you put your password and you allow it to do it in so while it's doing it in i would like to talk on something else. so when you come to this part you put yes okay then you allow it do it in so let me talk on something very quick um some people has been asked you've been ask, asking me um how you can support me in the little way uh i have a, a buy me a coffee page now i will put the link in the description below so this is it so you can support me with whatever you like uh, at least a coffee costs five dollars uh, three coffee 15 just anything you have you can support me if you want just for those who are asking how they can support me so let's go back to the installation then this b for 14 so uh I'm teaching this ethically for those who wants to uh, go into the red teaming uh, aspect of uh, ethical hacking. So I made a video previously earlier on about um, how to, um, when I advise you when you go to some places where you need to scan a QR code. Um, you should be mindful of the QR codes you scan in expensive restaurant and shops and outlet because somebody might change or might do something malicious with it so you have to stay safe and the motive of this video uh, it's for you to be aware okay um, so our installation is complete so in order to start up beef we use the same uh, command beef dash sss you hit enter uh, okay we must run the script as root so you can switch to root sorry so you must You must run the script as root so sorry for the typo error sudo su so now we are root so we run beef with beef dash xx xss so you hit enter so it's going to uh it said okay for your new installation your password must be different okay you're going to type your password so i already typed my password so now as you can see the framework um, has started okay the brief framework has started so this is the link we we'll use to go to our panel okay so we just copy the link my system is lagging behind so the so this is it um when it's open 
the username is beef and you put whatever password you choose okay so here's my password and i'll hit enter so it's authenticating never okay so this is the beef framework okay as you can see uh, before being able to fully exploit framework you have to hook a browser um this so let me explain something briefly so have you ever imagined where somebody maybe a malicious attacker used a link they get from beef and put it uh, convert it into a qr code for those who haven't watched the last video where i made um, uh, i showed you how you can change your website into a qr code maybe you have an a restaurant website where people can order just to make it classic some people use a qr code where you can scan you see the prices so now let's say somebody use a link maybe the qr code there is no longer the one for the restaurant and they put a malicious link so when you scan it they hooked your browser okay so uh what we are going to do is uh, okay advance here okay let's click this I'll try to open just bear with me uh with my uh internet it's really lagging behind today so this is the um how the the home page for beef looks like so uh, they can customize it and it's even going to look like the restaurant or whatever so you have to stay safe out there so let's see um let's go back to this uh, this thing here uh, maybe for example maybe this link for example let's go to let me go to another browser so it's uh, let's see here and i paste this i'm doing this in my own browser okay okay so i'll hit enter while it's loading let me show you something here in beef so when we go back to our dashboard here as you can see it's captured uh that um it has hooked you understand it captured like somebody has clicked the link and i mean uh kali linux so as you can see the amount of damages that can be done okay everything about your computer the details everything is going to be there so now when your browser is hooked a lot of things can be done so you go to command when you go to command So here in the command, as you can see, there's a lot of things, social engineering, as far as even for that persistence, like an attacker can uh, stay on, the, uh, on your phone, on your computer, even after you've turned it on and off again, they can still get the, this thing. So let me show you how it works. So let's say you choose one, maybe you choose one anyone you can go through all of them okay you can really go through all of them like the browser framework there's a lot of things you can do you can do the chrome can do a lot even in the social engineering part of it you can even uh, do a voice text okay okay so whichever one you want let's say you want um mm, maybe which one do we do now so you let me go to this uh, okay let's try exploit mm, so there's a whole lot you can do here 
okay for youtube co community guideline i won't do much but how to use it it's very simple when you choose the one you want let's say okay the browser for example so let's say we want um you want to play a sound okay you can click here you see here then you click on execute so i off the mic for my uh kali linux so it's not going to work okay so here when you, after you've done that when you click back to the command you're going to see the details and maybe in the browser of the person it's going to play whatever sound uh you really want it to play so this can go this can hook phone uh, uh even laptops or any device that has a, a browser so i'll be ending this video here 